Hey guys, Supreme Tuft here with another Lego Transformer. So here we have Flashback. Now Flashback is a mini version of a sail ship. And it does have two cannons, one in the front and one in the back. Along with a gray sail. Because I didn't have any 2x2 two two white pieces at the moment of this video. But yeah. So he's really small, like here he is with Micro. And Micro's about the same size as him. Here he is with Waterwing. Here he is with Stripes. And here he is with a minifigure. And he's basically the same size as a minifigure. Now if you wanted to, you could fold the cannons back in. And just make it slimmer, but I like to leave them out because it looks cool. But yeah, it is based around the one by two with the handles on each end with a jumper on top. But yeah, that's pretty much it for this mode. So let's get to the transformation. So, to transform him, the first thing you want to do is you want to turn the sail 90 degrees in either direction. Whether it be right or left, it really doesn't matter. Then you just want to rotate this 1x2 jumper. And then you just want to bring these pieces up. And then have the cannons go down. And here you have Flashback in his robot mode. So, as you can see, he is still pretty small. Like, here he is with Dragonfly. Oops. Here he is with Waterwing in his Dragonfly mode. Here he is with a minifigure. And he's about the same size as a minifigure. Here he is with Stripes. And finally, here he is with Micro. But yeah, so I think he turned out pretty good. And I will probably have more videos out of Transformers that are just based around the 1x2 with the two handles on each side. Like, I have a couple built. And I do have a Ravage design with this, so be sure to look out for that in the future. But yeah, so for articulation in this mode... The head can do a full 360, the arm can go up that far, and down that far, along with the actual like hand part being able to do a full 360, and you could put one of those one by ones with the handle on the side right here, but I thought that it wouldn't look very good in the sailboat mode, so I just left it out. And then he does have a waist swivel. So I thought that was pretty cool. And then he has an ab crunch. And the legs can go up that far and back that far. So yeah, and then, like I said before, waist swivel. So yeah. So if you do decide to build this, please be sure to give me credit since how I built it. But thanks for watching.